right, welcome to Skinny TV on YouTube once again. Let's talk about the Black Stars team. Yes, AFCON is just around the corner. As of the day I'm speaking, we have seven days for the AFCON to begin in Ivory Coast and Black Stars. We have to prepare well, go there and deliver in this particular AFCON. Now, Mohamed Kudus, many are talking about him. Is he in Ghana yet? Well, it is really interesting. I'll speak on that particular issue in this one. Then we'll look at African team with the most medals in this particular AFCON. Really interesting. We will check it out in this video. Then our focus will be on the best lineup, the strongest one for the Black Stars team for this AFCON. I've seen a lot of lineups going on on the internet. Many are talking about it. Some are saying we should go with the three back of which we are going to have Jiku, Amate and Salisu. Do you also agree to that? Well, we will check it out as I also give out my best starting 11 for this afcon so we check out the one trending and i'll also end it with my best one so yes you can also let me know your top 11 that you think coach chris hilton can use it to represent ghana we are not trying to dictate for the coach some will be like why are we trying to dictate he is the man who will take the final decision but we have been watching the players so which players do you think they can start and deliver for the black stars team let's talk about it as well in the comment box please like the video for me anytime join us do all the good stuff drop us a like let's try and get about 200 we have been hitting 200 of late thank you so much and also leave your thoughts and comments in the comment box if you are new subscribe to this channel because we have a lot of updates amazing updates coming your way on this channel this video is also brought to you in collaboration with pay angel money transfer pay angel money transfer anywhere you are based in europe or canada and you want to send money to someone in ghana here or any part of africa just go to payangel.com i'll leave the link in the video description and the comment box go there sign up right now if you use oskani as a referral you'll be given a bonus first of all on your first transaction and anytime you send money it is also free of charge go there sign up and bring me a good feedback on this channel now let's quickly jump into it no time to waste i also try and give some shout out to those who commented under the last video so stick and stay for that as well the black stars team yesterday they trained and yesterday it was just a gym work so we had 26 players out of 27 um you know getting the new guy that is inyaki williams to train with the team for the first time it was a good one today he also hit on the grounds to train um you know on the field yes yesterday was a gym work and they made sure that the team they'll be very fit for the upcoming tax ahead of them now the only player who is here to join camp is mohammed kudus he's the one that all of us are waiting for him what is going on i've heard reports i've read reports i've listened to news some are saying that kudus they saw him at the airport in ghana here and i was asking we Ghanaians, if someone sees kudus at the airport won't take their won't they take their phones to actually video him or take pictures with him no kudus has not been seen and i think he's still not in ghana personally that's what i think I've heard reports that he would have reported yesterday um, last two days we didn't see him yesterday too we, uh, we heard the same report we have not seen him and today we are here to see Mohamed Kudu so where you see if he hit the blast stars cap definitely they will post him just like how they posted in Yaki Williams yesterday so we are all here to see um, Kudus Mohamed I understand one he had a hamstring at West Ham United so West Ham they communicated to the Ghana Football Association that well they will have a scan on him and um, after that they will get to know what to do and according to Dr. Pambo and the Ghana Football Association um, you know, medical team they said that well, they are waiting for the report so that they will also know the, tech, uh, the tax ahead but this will allow Kudus to join the Black Stars team and now we have not heard anything West Ham they wish Kudus as well as Naif again best in the next AFCON meaning that they are going to release the boy but as of now we have not seen Kudus whether they have allowed him for Kudus to join the team or anything we cannot speak to that because no picture of him or no video of Kudus has seen uh, or has been seen um, you know around Ghana here and that is it on Mohamed Kudus so we are all waiting for him whether today you will see him around you know how we do it on this channel if I get it I'll bring you the latest on this channel so that is it on Kudus he has not been seen and he's only player who is yet to join the Black Stars camp now before we talk about the best 11 for the Black Stars team the African team with the most african medals yes this has been compiled by calf yes and i'm checking it out we have nigeria interestingly they have total um trophies or sorry total medals of 15 and winning the trophy the gold one that's the three times that the afcon then silver placing second four times in the afcon and bronze is eight times so they've actually placed third eight times in this particular africa cup of nation egypt they are actually holding the record for winning it the most that's seven times and they've also placed second three times and the third three times as well so totaling 15 uh, medals for them ghana we've won it four times as you know already and um we have silver that is placing second five times then bronze is one so ghana we like placing second oh look at it so that is it bronze one for ghana so totaling 10 coming with five then silver 
2, bronze 2, and totaling 9. So it continues just like that, as you can see it on your screen. So that is it for the African um, you know, countries with the most uh, medals in this particular AFCON. Let me know your thoughts in the comment box. Now, finally, let's talk about the best 11 that represents Ghana. I spotted this one, the 3 4 3 kind of formation, having Alexander Jiku, uh, Mohamed Salisu, and Daniel Amate as the three back. You know, Looking at the Black Stars team playing in those games that we played as three back, we really considered. And um, I think attacking wise, if you are going with you know full backs who are really good joining the attack, we will not have problem. But if you go with Ali Dusedu, he will not join the attack. If you go with um, Gideon Mensa, he's not really good joining the attack and um, assisting and other stuff. Unlike how Baba Rahman will give you that options or any other left fullback or right fullbacks in the team. So that is why, personally, I don't really feel the coach should go with a three back. And he's not a coach who really goes with that. If you look at the games that he attempted or he tried a three back, we really considered against USA, against Mexico, against Liberia, we considered as well, and some few other ones. But in all the competitive games, we've been seeing coach Chris Hutton has been going with a 4 4 2, um, sorry, 4 2 3 1, as he has been saying. And that is what I see him to be going into this AFCON with. Now, with a 3 4 3 formation, this is what I spotted. The second one I also spotted is this. That is also 4 2 3 1, how coach Chris Hutton has been setting his team. So the person also put in pose at Tizigi to be the number one. We also had Dennis Odoya as right back, left back, Gideon Mensa. Mohamed Salisu and Alexander Jiku was partner. I think these two will be the best partnership that we will have at the moment in the team. Um, Salis Abdul Samed will also be in the midfield with Majid Ashimeru. Then Kudus will play up front. Um, Jordan Ayu will be on the right wing. Osman Bukari on the left. And Inyaki Williams will also be leading the lines. This is one of the lineups that I saw. So these two are the ones I wanted to share with you as it was really trending on X. And I also want to share with you. Now, this is my possible starting 11 that I see Coach Chris Hilton to be going into this AFCON with. My only concern is Kudus. Right now, he's not in camp. And we don't know whether he's going to return as soon as possible to train with the team to have that cohesion and everything ahead of this AFCON. That is my only concern. So, yes, the goalkeeping aspect. I didn't go with the artistic as many were putting him in post. I think right now, the coach and everyone around the team is trying to gain that confidence in Richard Ofori. I don't know what they've seen in him. Even though he's somehow rusty for me because he's not getting a lot of games to play at Orlando Pirates. But, I um, you know, Atizgi is very consistent at his club side. But Ofori has that kind of command in his area and he's able to put the defense line, you know, intact. So, I'll place Richard Ofori in post for this particular AFCON best 11. Then, Dennis Odoi Professor, I'll put him at the right back. He has been giving us that options. We've seen him in the past two games for Ghana. He came on in the second half against Madagascar. And he played very well against Comoros, even though we lost in that game. So I'll place Odoi at the right back position. Then left back, I'll go for Gideon Mensah. Well, right now, he's giving us some good performances. So yes, I'll put him in there. Salisu Muhammad, as I said, um, and Jiku will be the best partner in the Black Stars team currently. Salisu is, is a left center back. Then Jiku is going to be my right center back. And that is it. Now, Majid Ashimeru, yes, I'll partner him with Salis Abdul Samed in the midfield. You know, these two, I think they are going to do well. Um, Salisu will be, um, sorry, Salis Abdul Samed will be the um, defensive midfielder here. Then, offensively, I'll have Majid Ashimeru to be doing the ball progression in the midfield for Ghana. Mohamed Kudus. I'll play him in the number 10 position, as we call it. Yes, um, that's the AM role. Then, Inyaki Williams, I'll put him at the right wing position. I'll not start Inyaki as the main number 9. No, I'll place him at where he has been playing. And he has been doing well for Athletic Boba. That's the right wing position. And I'll play Jordan Ayu as a left winger in this team. Jordan as a left winger. Then, I will have Antoine Salom Semenyo as the number 9 or the lead man in this current Black Stars team. So, this... It's my the best 11. I'm looking at this current Black Stars team. Well, many can make cases for the likes of NS Noama, who has also been doing well in the Black Stars team. He can also come in. I will not be surprised. Then, um, having other players like um, Osman Bukari, very good form. He can also come in and start. Joseph Pinto is also one guy who can come in and start. I will not be surprised. So, yes, Ali Duseidu can also come in. But Ali Duseidu, we should note, he has been starting as a centre-back for Clermont Fort mostly in his career. And, um, um, I don't really see him to be playing as a right back in this particular Black Stars team at the moment because he doesn't really add up going forward as a right back. You know, in the modern day football, sometimes you have to add up 
in terms of attack and defensively you have to also be solid so that is it for you guys let me know your thoughts in the comment box which of the three lineups are you happy with is it the first one i shared with you the second one i shared or my third one that i spoke about let me know your thoughts in the comment box now let me give shout outs in this video before i take leave of you shout outs going on to uh blue view capital thank you for being here i appreciate you i have gabriel from Pong. thank you for being here aquabua you also on this channel i appreciate you a lot thomas afrasikwesi thank you ebenezer jc is also here El Capitano, I appreciate you a lot for your comment. Prince Ahiale, thank you. Rocky Ima is also on this channel. Ujabu, thank you for being here, Ujabu. Nathaniel Diagram is also on this channel. Nice guy, thank you. Soa Joseph is also here. Amwa, um, Amwacho Joshua, thank you. Amwacho Joshua, thank you. Swanzi Kuje is here. Um, right up right above heat wow right above heat thank you for being here i've seen you yes um then i have um swanzi koji okay azuma obed thank you asunaba you are also on this channel asunaba i've seen you you are doing great kings king oh think king oh thank you for being here um then i have whoa don't call thank you mommy beatrice you also on this channel sika brands here i've seen you richard edry is also here then i have um who again tactician yes Orlando tactician thank you jason grant is also on this channel quadrados i've seen you with the flowers here um then i have who again abdul razak thank you for being here elijah ando kinsley i appreciate you amura jonas is also here emmanuel amani is here auntie becky is here inketia ns is here do emmanuel is here um samuel kwao is here gideon akabo thank you um then i have sakwa ebenezer Isaac Dramina ID, Charles Dapa, Diko and um, Amin, Diko Amin, you said you are here, but I never hear from you. Well, um, I said you should contact me. My contact is in the description box, guys. So, these are some of the few shout outs for you to them somehow down, but you know, I'll come good. Just stick and stay for more updates, guys. Let me know your thoughts in the comment box. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe, put on the bell for more updates here on this channel. This was Kenny TV, and of course, we shall meet later.